Hello everyone and welcome to this new video. Lots of surprises today. So let's go first of all to what everybody wants to see first. At least I'm pretty sure about this. 2-2 was the final score of the match that was played yesterday. Uh, unfortunately, mm, well, there's a number of factor, uh, factors to take into consideration. Some of them were pretty strange, some of them were very unlucky. But finally, 2-2. Two -two. Uh, and despite the opponents being, well, having a, a good squad anyway, but um, this was not supposed to be the final result, I believe. Um, even more if we consider what these stats say. So, as you can see, all right, the uh, score is 2 2, but 60% ball position for the opponents who were playing attacking, and they had a very, um, I would say, well, experience wise, their midfield, the opponent's midfield, was very strong. So, despite the lack of skills they could somewhat compensate uh, and this made this thing turn out against 40 percent of course and then but then we've got three shots throughout the match against 11 two shots on target and this is crazy two shots on target two uh, two goals i mean our goalkeeper, we know our goalkeeper is not impressive or highly impressive if we consider the level of this championship, but of the of the league, sorry. But come on, two shots on target, two goals. I think I've never seen anything like this before. And then nine shots on target, we could score twice. This is more realistic, I believe. And then five set, set pieces against four. The opponents were playing attacking, which might explain this thing. Um, well, actually, in this case, I think two strikers like these against basically one defender like this is very experienced. So he's supposed to be, well, knowing what he does on the pitch. But have a look at the stats well uh, it's just something quite funny I believe uh, it's just funny and uh, well but in addition on top of that we have a very important injury which occurred when we were leading I believe yes we were leading 1-0 and then this injury occurred and uh, yeah unfortunately we could not stop the opponents from scoring and this well this is the final outcome luckily we'll have very uh, very tough matches ahead so this is not going to matter very much in my opinion so have a look we sit here sixth place in the league and uh, the opponents are not too far so our direct opponent sits uh, seven points away, which is not that bad, but it's not much either. As I said, we'll, we're about to play very, very difficult matches, and I am pretty sure we're going to lose nearly all of them. So at least the next uh, four, I believe, not sure. I have to double check, but next four matches or five will be very, very tough. So we're not supposed to win and not supposed to draw either. We're going to play against Vitim. I believe Servi de la Gliber as well, not sure. Belo Cassone for sure. Jacko Football Club for sure. I believe Partenope as well. Uh, so it's going to be very, very difficult. And ah, yeah, that's it. Uh, I think... Uh, well, these two points would have meant uh, lots of things, a uh, lot of things, and a load more hopes to um, to get to the tenth position in the end. 
eventually we haven't got the uh, the score we wanted and in my opinion we deserved but yeah let's face it it's not over and we can still make up for this uh, well half defeat so guys thanks a lot again for watching and see you tomorrow for a very interesting video bye